Hello from the ST Standard Embedded World in Nuremberg. Now, turning ideas into applications faster is a key question for developers and makers. Carl Owen, the boss of DSB Robotics, is here to help me find some solutions. And speed really is a crucial factor, isn't it? Yes, definitely. What we're doing is working on rapid prototyping and minimum viable products to try and get products to market quicker and thus save money. And we do that using our software, which is called Flowstone, which is a combination of graphical and text-based programming. And what about programming technologies and languages? Yeah, it's an interesting subject because there's so many different languages now. You can program in C, in Python, in Ruby, in assembler language. There's, there's so many choices and it's quite confusing. So what we've done is take horses for courses. We've used high-level languages to do the high-level stuff like graphics, video processing, audio, and then we've used the lower lang level languages like C to program the microprocessors to do the sort of tricky stuff. Tell me a little bit about the work you're doing in the field of education. Yeah, what we're doing with education is we've brought out this new product which is the Flowpore product, which is uh, a hardware interface to help sort of show the features of the software. And we're working with Conrad in Germany particularly who are putting together an education package for schools, which is be a combination of our software, uh, the hardware we make, and also teacher content, books for students, and sort of wrap it all up in curriculum-based content, so they've actually got something to work through, project-based. And what's been the feedback? Uh, the feedback's been phenomenal. I think uh, the problem is teachers are very busy people, and they need to learn this new technology as everybody else does. So opening it up to something that's uh, sort of achievable and isn't too technical and complicated that works in the classroom straight away without actually having to fight the hardware, install drivers and all this kind of stuff. They just plug it in, play, and the teachers understand it. The kids can start coding and hacking the stuff we've done, and it works really well. Now, I can't let you go, of course, without asking about robotics. Uh, what are the headlines in that world? Well, as you know, I write for Robot Magazine in America, and they've been using uh, robotics to teach programming for a number of years. Clearly, that hasn't happened in Europe yet, so this is quite exciting that this technology is going to move into Europe, and the Flowpore system with the Flowstone software is the ideal product to actually bring that into the classroom. So we're really excited in 2015 about the robotics world. Carl, thank you for your time, and enjoy Embedded World 2015. Yeah, thank you.